Mini Mod Monday, this time HVAC Expansion, mod made by Redstone Paradox, and the art as well as the animation is made by Scientist UA. Every new HVAC building has a different function, dumping heat into a gas or a liquid to cool their surroundings, or condensing gases into liquids, or evaporating liquids into gases while extracting heat from the surrounding area. The thermo conditioner is the counterpart to the base game thermo regulator. It cools the area around the building by extracting its heat and transfers the heat to a gas passing the building. Here in this case the gas is coming in at 64 degrees celsius and it leaves the building at around 80 degrees celsius. This process is so incredibly efficient that it is super easy to produce liquid oxygen. In a regular game scenario I would probably build something like this. Or an even easier setup could be that you just dump the hot gas into an ice biome and then repurpose it. It can be found under the utility tab and needs 200 metal ore to be built. The second building we are taking a look at is the Thermo Aqua Cooler, cooling the surrounding of the building while dumping the heat into a liquid that flows into it. For this you can basically use any regular aqua tuner setup, but you will need to find a method to cool your turbine. The Thermo Aqua Cooler will cost you 1200 metal ore. The auto condenser was a little bit harder to understand. It uses piped gases, condenses them into liquids and cooling them down a little bit. Meaning if you pipe in steam at around 110 degrees celsius, the building will condense it to 97 degrees celsius water while giving off the excess heat to the surrounding area. Do keep in mind that this works for a lot of gases. So if you accidentally suck up oxygen, you will make liquid oxygen at room temperature. That may lead to one or two problems. This building only needs 100 kg of refined metal. This next building took me a while to not destroy it every time I use it. We are talking about the auto evaporator, which evaporates piped liquids into slightly warmer gases using the surrounding in quotes heat for that. Meaning if you feed in water at 96 degrees celsius, you will get steam at around 103 degrees celsius while cooling the surrounding area big time. Be aware that you can't use liquids that are far away from their condensation point, otherwise the building will break a lot. But I still managed to cheese the system by using only 10 grams of water, giving us steam at 71 degrees celsius. This building needs 100 refined metal as well. The HVAC research gives you 3 of those buildings and the last one can be unlocked with the liquid tuning. The power consumption to the base game counterparts is equal to the original. The other two need 480 watts. And now check out this ridiculousness. I am using the evaporation of 96 degrees hot liquid water into its gaseous steam state to rid the environment around the buildings of its temperature, creating liquid hydrogen and liquid oxygen in the process. This is a super simple setup to create rocket fuel and its liquid oxidizer. Or you know, you could do dumb shit like this. Subscribe for weekly mod showcases and thanks a lot to my two new members. And yes, that means you can become a member now. Mostly this will be to support the channel, but you will get an occasional contraption that I'm working on in the background. Love you guys and Luma out.